Moving on to the NBA, where the Eastern Conference race is getting interesting for the Milwaukee Bucks. You recall Milwaukee fired head coach Adrian Griffin in January, when even though he had led the team to a 30-13 and 13 record over their first 43 games. They replaced him with Doc Rivers, who so far has a 500 record as the Bucks cling to the number two seed overall. Check this out now. The Miami Heat are surging as the seventh seed. And rating MVP Joel Embiid returned to the Sixers lineup this week, who currently occupy the eighth seed. So here's the question. If you're a Bucks fan, if you're a Milwaukee Bucks fan right now, you might be a little concerned. And my question to you would be this. Who you want? You want Joel Embiid and, 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 and Tyrese Maxey, or do you want the Miami Heat? Now, the Miami Heat lost to the Philadelphia 76ers last night. Embiid dropped 29 in just the second game back. Maxey was out for a couple of games. His first game back, he dropped 37, the brother special. And I'm looking if Embiid is healthy and Maxey is healthy, you don't want any piece of Philadelphia if you are the Miami Heat, in my estimation. You bam out of bio, the last person you should want to face, other than Nikola Jokic, is Joel Embiid. The flip side to it, however... If you're the Milwaukee Bucks, okay, Miami has had its way with you on a couple of occasions over the last few years. Jimmy Buckets elevates his level of play, averages 21 during the regular season, 21 in the postseason. Tyler Hero, whenever he's healthy enough to play, he's a 20-point-per-game scorer and a 40% shooter from three-point range. They picked up Terry Rozier, who's averaging 20 for them. You still got out of bio. You still got the Duncan Robinsons of the world and others, even though Duncan Robinson only had two points last night. The bottom line is, I don't know who you should want if you're the Milwaukee Bucks the way that you're looking. All I would tell you is this. You need Damian Lillard because you're like 1-7 or 1-8 and eight without him. You don't win games without Damian Lillard in Milwaukee. And they miss Drew Holiday. Let's see what they do. I would say this. The Milwaukee Bucks, they should want Philadelphia. Because there's a better chance that Joel and Beatle get hurt during the playoffs than one of the members of the Miami Heat. It's basically by default. Because I think this Milwaukee Bucks team that I've been watching would lose to either one of them. I truly believe that. 